<laughs> the first tip would be go sailing with them first before you jump <laughs> in the boat. But it doesn't seem to matter because we managed to win the first race. <laughs> so perhaps it's, it's, it's beginner's luck on the first one, but I'm in awe of, of Emma's communication, you know, in terms of the, what she feels on the spinnaker and she's saying, got pressure, go up, go down. It's just phenomenal what she's, uh, what she's feeding back to me. Um, and I think for us, it's about maintaining positivity. Like, yeah, if you hit a bad wave, and you then get all grumpy about it, then both of you are just going to get into a downward spiral, whereas actually it's about just moving on from that and making the boat go fast. Um, so we, on the first start, on the way out to the first start, spent a long time talking about what our communication was going to be. So there was never any doubt about what someone meant, so you couldn't get offended. Yeah. It's about making the boat go fast and having fun, not having a go at each other. Yeah. Yeah. Don't try and force the mode. Um, if it's soaking or if it's pushing downwind, just sail the mode with the breeze that you're in, not the breeze that you would necessarily like to be, and hike really, really hard. You and Payne need to come to a good relationship nice and early in your 200 career. Get to the line early. Yeah. Because if you're, if you're not at the line early and past the, the guard boat early, then you're going to get left with all the dead air that that gets left yeah. behind because there's so many boats. And also, you need to know where you're starting. Don't just kind of hit and miss. You've got to have a plan. Keep clear air upwind, yeah. I think, and get round the windward and then make the most of being lightweight downwind. So keep, yeah. make sure you're in a gap, got some clear air, and soak as low as you can. Uh, I don't tend to change the boat setup all that much, actually. So we, I pretty much sailing the same in, in, with Alex as I did with my wife. We keep it uh, rake the same. Um, obviously, we're flattening off the sails a bit more when it's really windy. Um, and then I'm just soaking as best we can, so get the speed on and then take it, take the depth with the lightweight downwind.